इन्फ्लुएंसेस ऑन इंडियन मॉनसून द इन्फ्लुएंसेस क्या है वन इन्फ्लुएंसेस द ट्रेड विंड्स द ट्रेड विंड्स विच आर द सरफेस विंड्स बट रिमेंबर दैट दीज गेट मॉडिफाइड तो ये एक इन्फ्लुएंस है कि मॉनसून बनता कैसे है एंड रिमेंबर आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट दीज इन्फ्लुएंसेस मेनली इन अ रेफरेंस टू साउथ एशिया एंड इंडिया बिकॉज साउथ एशिया इंडिया में मॉनसून आर बेस्ट डेवलप्ड मॉनसून का जो डेवलपमेंट है मॉनसून का जो जो मैनिफेस्टेशन है इट इज बेस्ट फॉर साउथ एशिया एंड इंडिया ओके तो वन इंपॉर्टेंट इंफ्लुएंस इज ट्रेड विंड्स विच आर सर्फेस विंड एंड देर मॉडिफाइड द सेकेंड वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट इंफ्लुएंस इज द डिफरेंस ऑफ लैंड वॉटर टेम्परेचर कंट्रेस्ट Difference of land, water, temperature, contrast. Water is warmer in the winters. Water is cooler in the summers. So land water difference है. So India India का जो coastline presence है, वो भी बहुत important influence है. The land difference, land water contrast. The third influence is the upper tropospheric winds. We know about jet streams, okay, and uh, three jet streams. play very important role the subtropical westerly jet stream this is approximately around 30 degrees north pe hota hai and it is over india in the winters the upper tropospheric winds mein the role of jet streams subtropical westerly jet streams jo approximately 30 degrees north mein hota hai north mein hota hai and the jet streams are over india in the winters in the summers they go further northwards okay that's one jet stream the second jet stream is the tropical easterly jet stream which is over india over india in the summer monsoon months summer monsoon months east jet stream and this is at around 14 degrees north latitudes ye ye dono jet streams india pe throughout the year nahi hote hain okay stwj is over india in the winters whereas tropical easterly jet stream is over india okay in the summer monsoon months both are very important for the rainfall patterns the third jet stream is the somali jet stream this is present of the somali coast and in the summer monsoon months there is some kind of seasonal variations in the jet streams somali jet streams they are off 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 somali coast like africa ke coast se arabian sea mein off somali coastline and they impact the monsoons in the summer monsoon months stwj ka jo role hai the main role of this is the western disturbances and monsoon burst iska role hai uh, strengthening southwest monsoon winds and somali jet stream ka bhi role hai uh, strengthening southwest monsoon winds the role of stwj is western disturbances and a phenomena called as monsoon burst the monsoons they happen suddenly the monsoons rains okay they happen suddenly along the malabar coast usko bolte hain monsoon burst tropical easterly jet stream and the somali jet stream both are important for a strengthening of southwest monsoon winds when these two are strong the rains over india are good the rains over india are good बाय द वे ये वेस्टर्न डिस्टर्बेंसेस हैं दीज आर इन द विंटर्स दीज आर इन द विंटर्स आई कम बैक ऑन दिस इन सम अदर वे सो व्हाट आर द इन्फ्लुएंसेस ऑन इंडियन मॉनसून वन इज द सरफेस विंड्स द ट्रेड विंड्स सेकंड इज लैंड वाटर डिफरेंस द थर्ड इज अपर ट्रोपोस्फेरिक विंड्स ठीक है अच्छा द फोर्थ इन्फ्लुएंस द फोर्थ इन्फ्लुएंस इज the location location and the strength of itcz 
the location and the strength of ITCZ. What ITCZ does is, it is also called as monsoon trough. It's also called as the monsoon, T-R-O-U-G-H. Monsoon trough ka matlab hai, low pressure belt hai. It's also called as monsoon trough or referred to as the low pressure belt. And this ITCZ, this is the main okay, low pressure belt that pulls that pulls the southwest monsoon winds northwards. If low pressure nahi hoga, the winds will not move towards the land. They pull the southwest monsoon winds northwards. And this ITCZ, okay, during the rainy monsoon season, during the uh, uh, rainy uh, monsoon season, it is located at around, it is, it is located at around rainy monsoon seasons. It is located, it is located on the northern plains uh, between 25, 20 degrees north latitude. It is located on the northern plains between 25, 20 degrees north latitude. And please know that its position its position is not always stable. It can shift north and south. Uske vajha se droughts hoti hain, floods hoti hain. The position is not fixed. It is not stable. It can shift north and south. During the rainy monsoon seasons, it is located on the northern plains between 25, 20 degrees north and north latitude. And its position is not always stable. It shifts north and south. So something like this, agar this is India, like this, the Himalayas. Hai. So your ITCZ kuch aise hota hai. This is your ITCZ. And this ITCZ, kya karega? It will pull the winds towards itself. It will pull the winds towards itself. Okay, this is the ITCZ in the summers at around... 20, 25 degrees north latitude. And it can also keep on shifting. So this is the main low pressure that pulls the winds. This is the Arabian Sea branch. This is the Bay of Bengal branch. They pull called as the Bay of Bengal branch. And this is called as Arabian Sea branch. And uh, these together is southwest monsoon winds. ITCZ, Intertropical Convergence Zone, also called as Equatorial Trough. Okay, or India me isko bolte hai, the Monsoon Trough. Intertropical Convergence Zone, the zone where the trade winds meet. The zones where the trade winds meet. Okay, so this is your fourth influence, correct? The fifth influence the fifth influence is the Himalayas. The Himalayas are another influence. Himalayas ka do teen role hai. One is, okay, they, they create, they create the distinct, distinct uh, climate of South Asia and block the Central Asian, okay, uh, cold winds. Uh, from impacting South Asia, they create distinct climate of South Asia. If the Himalayas are not in South Asia, there is no type of climate zone. Banta nahi. Okay, Himalayas, they are kind of what we call as climatic divide. Hai ye. Okay, ye South Asia is different. Central Asia, Siberia is different. So, Himalayas are a type of climate divide. They are a type of climate divide. Okay, they separate the climate of Central Asia, jo kafi thand hota hai, snowfall hota hai yaan par, in winters. And South Asia's are warmer, South Asia is wetter. Okay, to ye ek role hai Himalayas ka. The second important role Himalayas is that they modify, that they modify the uh, subtropical westerly jet streams. They modify the subtropical westerly jet streams 
and are responsible for the western disturbances they are responsible for the western disturbances light rainfall of the winters light rainfall of the winters so ye himalayas hain a uh, jet stream coming from the west and it gets blocked here the jet stream coming from the west ye purvanchal hills hain they get blocked here this areas the north western area of india and the north eastern areas of india they receive light rains in the winters they modify the subtropical westerly jet streams okay they are responsible for the western western disturbance rains in the winters aur ye kahan par hota hai ye hota hai northwest india mein including kashmir punjab himachal aur hota hai idhar upper assam mein upper assam i think humne kaha bhi hoga brahmaputra receives rains twice once in the winters once in the summers ye himalayas hain this is the himalayas the himalayas they are blocking the jet stream ye jet stream aa raha hai it gets blocked here to so, is area mein rains hota hai the jet streams they are blocked here this area has rains this is north western india kashmir himachal pradesh uh, uttarakhand northern rajasthan uh, punjab uh, haryana uh, western up these areas have rains kashmir mein main rainy season is ओके अप्रैल में ओके तब होता है रेन्स कश्मीर में सेम इज हिमाचल प्रदेश हैज सम रेन्स स्नोफॉल ओके तो विंटर्स में है बट रेन्स प्रॉपर इज दैट टाइम दिल्ली में रेनफॉल होती है वेस्टर्न यूपी में रेनफॉल होती है तो नॉर्थ वेस्टर्न इंडिया में एंड इन पार्ट्स ऑफ अपर असम इन नॉर्थ ईस्ट यहां पर भी रेन्स होती है इसी रेन्स को बोलते हैं वेस्टर्न डिस्टर्बेंसेस वेस्टर्न बिकॉज they come from the west okay ye jo ye jo jet stream hai it just this is jet stream okay this is the subtropical westerly jet stream ye aati hai west se they come from the west and they are blocked by himalayas causing rains here and having rains here. that's all and just know that ye jo rainfall hai winters wala it's very good for the rabi crops like wheat like mustard like chana gram ye rainfall ki wajah se you have got good harvest of the rabi crops good harvest of rabi r a b i rabi crops himalayas ka the sixth influence is the tibetan plateau the sixth influence is the tibetan plateau ye bahut important hai there was a scientist called as kutishwaran uh, he talked about the uh, role of tibetan highlands okay hum 1970s ki baat kar rahe hain there was a indo russian okay ek uh, uh, project tha okay called as the monex monsoon expedition monex project okay is project mein This man Kutishwaran said कि टिबेटन प्लेटो का बहुत अहमियत है टिबेटन प्लेटो हैज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट रोल टू प्ले ओके सो टिबेटन प्लेटो वॉट डज इट डू ओके इट इज द हीटिंग इट इज द हीटिंग ऑफ द टिबेटन प्लेटो दैट इन द समर्स इन द समर्स दैट दैट क्रिएट्स दैट क्रिएट्स low pressure and it energizes the tropical easterly jet stream the heating of the tibetan plateau in the summers in the summers it creates a low pressure it creates a low pressure and that energizes the tropical easterly jet stream iske bina monsoons will not be as powerful तो हमारा प्रॉब्लम ये ना टिबेट कहते ही आवर इमेजिनेशन इज दैट टिबेट इज ओके ऑल कोल्ड ओनली आइस स्नोफॉल ओके ऐसा नहीं है टिबेट कैन बी प्रिटी वॉर्म ओके समर्स में दे बिकम ग्रासलैंड्स दे बिकम ग्रेजिंग लैंड्स काफी हॉट होता है टिबेट ठीक है सो टिबेट एट ऑल्टीट्यूड इट आल्सो हैज लेस एटमोस्फेयर तो इंसुलेशन है वो बहुत पावरफुल होगा 
तो टिबेटन हीटिंग इन द समर्स क्रिएट्स अ लो प्रेशर सो इंडिया के ऊपर में ओके देयर आर टू इंपॉर्टेंट लो प्रेशर सिस्टम्स वन इज द आईटीसीजेड द सेकंड इज टिबेटन प्लेटो बोथ प्ले अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट रोल इट एनर्जाइजेस द ट्रॉपिकल ईस्टर्ली जेट स्ट्रीम इट एनर्जाइजेस द ट्रॉपिकल ईस्टर्ली द ट्रॉपिकल ईस्टर्ली जेट स्ट्रीम शॉर्ट में हम इसको बोलते हैं टीईजे इसके बिना मॉनसून नहीं हो वन रीजन व्हाई इंडियन मॉनसून आर वेरी डिफरेंट फ्रॉम एनी अदर मॉनसून बिकॉज बाकी जगह टिबेट जैसा प्लेटो नहीं है मैसिव प्लेटो एट एलिवेशन ऑफ मोर देन फाइव थाउजेंड मीटर्स आप देखो आप ऐसा बड़ा सा प्लेटो है ये हिमालयाज हैं एंड दिस शिवालिक्स एंड द नदर प्लेन्स इतना बड़ा प्लेटो द एवरेज हाइट इज मोर देन फाइव थाउजेंड मीटर्स एंड द सनलाइट द स्ट्रॉन्ग इंसुलेशन दिस कैन हीट इट अप इट फॉर्म्स अ लो प्रेशर एरिया इतना बड़ा प्लेटो और कहीं नहीं है सो इफ लुक एट इंडिया इंडिया मॉनसून कंडीशन दिस इज हिमालयाज दिस इज द टिबेत प्लेटो हिमालयाज टिबेत प्लेटो okay this is kach kathiawad what impacts monsoons ye tibetan plateau mein yahan par low pressure hai and yahan par itcz hai this also is a low pressure system these two together responsible for dragging the winds okay towards india these two together will force the winds towards india this is the tibetan low pressure this is the itcz low pressure these two together play a very important role the six influences on indian monsoons so keep drawing keep sketching you'll have a pictorial idea kahan par kya hai